Hey footy fans, it's Ed from Sporting News here. We're in Brisbane at Suncorp Stadium for Magic Round this weekend. The biggest discussion point this weekend has been the referees ruling on head contact and sending players to the sin bin. We're going to have a chat to the fans around Suncorp Stadium to see what they think about it. It's a bit over the top, but uh, it's, yeah, it's the way the game's got to go, I think. We've got to stop stop these head injuries uh, moving forward we've got to stop it you know so it's a bit over the top this round but yeah they all know they, they can't c can't make contact with the head so so yeah they pay the price if they do oh, honestly I think it's ruining the game it's just I can understand it but I think it's a bit you know they need to tweak it a bit I think but you know first time bringing it in so see how it goes look mate it's been some awesome football but yeah the sim meaning and the refereeing uh, they're, in, they're not hiding nothing, but I mean, it's affected the out outcomes of some of the games, and it's a shame. And we're talking about it. We're not talking about the brilliance of the players and uh, some of the feats you see on the field. You know, we can score it in the corner with it when they're three metres out. So that's the stuff we should be talking about. I think the NRL need to get it right and get it back to uh, what rugby league is. I see what they're doing. I can see why they're making these rules in for the future. It's a funny weekend to pick though to really start to crack down. You gotta you gotta do it over the off season, I reckon. We used to do it with rule changes. You you trial it over the off season, give teams enough time to prepare for, for how it's gonna be officiated and stuff like that. Yeah they're they're doing their part of it and um, making it soft. Yeah. For us us boys born and raised playing rugby league the physicality was a big part of, of the game. And it set us apart from others, especially rugby. <laughs> And um, now it feels like, uh, yeah, they're taking the um, physical physicality out of it, and and uh, therefore, you know, all the physical guys are going to get driven out if it keeps going. And they're going to, as Ricky said, you're going to look for other types of players and the Sean Johnson touch players like Callum Ponga. You're going to have 13 of those blokes running out soon. So yeah, it's the evolution. I'm I'm one of those ones that understands the plight of the NRL, and um, if we're going to have a um, if we're going to have a game in the future, uh, any any type of rugby league game with contact sport, then we've got to get away from the head. So um, this is the transition period. So it's it's going to be it's not going to be comfortable for the, all the fans, and I've got plenty of mates that don't want to be don't want to know about it at the moment. But that's um, that's fine. It slows it down, you know. Some of them they're a bit off and on, you know. Some are some are bad, some aren't. So I think they need to go back and look at it after this. But you know, it is what it is. They got to protect the players, so. Yeah, I do understand. I do understand the reasoning behind it. Um, Big Papa didn't answer my call this morning, so he's, <laughs> he's still filthy. Oh, look, I think it's it's one of those things that we'll get used to pretty quick. You know, um, yeah, the game is definitely a lot quicker this year, and uh, you can see in the fatigue in the players and uh, and the scores, big scores in the in the second halves. You know, so that fit teams with the little fast players, yeah, put some points on. This generation won't know any different. So yeah, we just uh, our generation, my generation might know, yeah, might reminisce over the old days, but um, yeah, this generation won't know any different. So it's just going to be fast, exciting, flowing footy, and um, and with uh, less and less injuries. So player welfare is number one, in my opinion. It's got to go back to that. I mean, that's how we differentiated our product in the game. If you want to talk marketing terms, it's they like, seem to love. We were, it was hard, it was fast, it was fair, you know, and. Um, I think now we're trying to make it too much, too uh, politically correct. So go back to what we know. If it's not right for everyone, the people who are loyal will be here every week, which we are. So please give us our game back, Mr. Landis.